Hey you guys, I'm so sorry. I have to start off this video on the horrible, um, what's it called? Like computer camera, but it's like reversed. It's, whoa, it's really messing. Whoa, it's really messing with me right now. This is weird. Ah! <laughs> I feel like I have to do it with my eyes closed. Okay, anyway, I'm just coming on here to let you guys know that um, the last vlog, um, it just like got super long. So I have all this footage that I didn't, in didn't include in the last vlog. So what I did was I just put it into a new vlog. So here's the, I guess, part two to my last vlog. So if you haven't watched my last vlog, maybe you should go watch that first. If you didn't, it's really probably not a big deal also. But um, I just wanted to like kind of explain that because I started off the video like without saying anything and it's like kind of like hello. So I just wanted to insert a clip saying that. But please do not click off because of this horrible, weird camera. I promise I have a much better camera that you'll be seeing right now. Hey you guys, sorry, I was charging my camera and I forgot to show you guys my final product of my bagel, but I'll insert a picture for you guys. Um, but I'm gonna do the dishes, or maybe load up the dishwasher, because I think I already have dishes in there actually, but I have a bunch of dishes that I gotta put in there. I'm watching the new episode, or not the new episode of the Kardashians, I realized I hadn't finished the whole last week's episode so i'm watching that or finishing that and then i'm gonna watch the new one i'm freezing my door still open oh my god and it's beautiful and my candle i brought over here now i like to transport it look oh my god i wish there was no screen but isn't that beautiful oh shoot <laughs> i ruined it hold on let's open this i don't really know what it works for Wow, that's gorgeous. I can't get enough. And I'm burning the candle <clears throat> and I'm still, I still have the door open because I love the fresh air. But I'm gonna do dishes now. You guys don't make fun of me, but the Kardashians ended and now I'm watching the D'Amelio show. <laughs> I just started it, but I put on the most recent episode because I didn't want to watch the first one. But I just wanted I just wanted something to watch. There's no more YouTube videos for me to watch. And I wanted someone to watch while I was assembling the lamps. So look, I put them together. Remember I told you guys about this? But they don't match, see? Gold, silver, but like whatever. They look fine from afar. So I don't like it next to the TV because I feel like a lamp next to a TV is weird. I like this one here, but it doesn't reach the thing. So I'm gonna go see if I have an extension cord or something. I'm still burning this candle, it tastes delicious. I mean, smells. I'm drinking water. Don't know where that came from. Um, I was gonna go assemble the shower shelves now. Oh, well I guess this is an extension cord. Oh, should I put out the Christmas candles too? Yay! I can turn off this lamp, but I don't want it right here. Well, do I? Because I just don't know where to put the Christmas trees. I was going to put them on either side of the TV. But would the little one fit in here? No. Hmm. Should I put it on the countertop? Which one should I put on the countertop? Or should I keep them together? <laughs> I have so many questions. 
Should I keep the white one in here because everything's white and put the pink one on the countertop? Or would the pink one not match the countertop either? I guess it wouldn't match the countertop either, but like, who cares? Because I don't think my bar stools will reach all the way over there anyway. Sorry, I'm not really showing you guys. Is that cute? <laughs> Whatever. Okay. And then, I guess the lamp is gonna stay there. No. Wait. <laughs> I just don't like a lamp next to a TV for some reason. But is that like just my problem? No, it looks so stupid. <laughs> I don't know what to do about it though. Maybe I'll get another sort of table because I shouldn't be on the coffee table either. Okay, I have to throw this away. <laughs> These are both for my bathroom, so let's go. I'm gonna do that better later, but I'll put the scale right there so I could just step on it right here, stand on it, and whatever. And then my bags, I'll fix them later. <laughs> we'll go right there. Towels are right there for now, but I'm probably gonna change it. And then, oh yeah, I wanted to put two towels, two of the waffle towels on that thing. But let's set up the shelves too. Oh, the whole family's in Naples without me. They're so rude. Oh, I also wanted to clean the bathroom. Do I have the bathroom cleaner in here? I get paper towels. I also need to put like tissues on my list. I just need to go to Target, but it's still early. I have time. So they just hang up on this thing like this. But it's not sticky. Tear off protective film. There's a protective film. Oh, 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 I see it. Okay, so it is sticky. Okay. <laughs> it's not straight! My camera's gonna die, so I'll have to update you guys. Whatever it does. How much better is that? I don't even need the second shelf. I'll save it in the cabinet though. And I'll update you guys later. I gotta charge my camera again. Okay, you guys, quickly, let me show you what I did. I'm about to throw away all that stuff, but my camera's literally about to die. I was just coming to plug it in, but I did some organizing with the little bins. Organize, toothbrush, razor heads. Um, <laughs> over here is just some random stuff that I use constantly, some pimple patches and little things that I use too, jewelry, a little lighter, and under here I just have storage, a phone stand, a little shower shelf I didn't use, and then all my little bags that I always use. As I said, better throw this stuff away. I hung up the shower shelf. Did I show you guys this? Added some things to it, and here's how the bathroom's looking. I'm about to clean the entire bathroom. I'll probably charge my camera while I clean the entire bathroom, but I'm going to use, like, this bathroom cleaner and just some like paper towels and deep clean the whole bathroom. So I'll see you guys later. Sorry, I'm out of breath. Okay, you guys, I just finished cleaning the bathroom. Well, I'm not even done, but I'll show you what I've done. I used the, bath used the bathroom cleaner. I scrubbed the walls, the floor, the drain, everything in here. Everything was clean. And then I used Windex on the glass and did the shower handles too. And then I did the tub. It was really hard work, you guys. Like, I scrubbed every corner. I did the whole inside of the tub, all the little silver pieces outside of the tub. That little thingy, you know, everywhere. And what I haven't done is the toilet or the countertops and sinks over here. But my hands are so dry from, like, touching the spray, I feel like, so much. And I have to find where I put. Because I just organized all this. All of the cabinets. Where did I put the hand lotion? <laughs> oh, okay. This came in my Fab Fit box. It's like cream, whatever. Oh, low. I don't know how to say the brand. I'm not even gonna try. But that's how much cleaning I've done so far. I need Laneige. 
I'm actually gonna brush my teeth. What time is it? I think I'm gonna run to Target or something similar to Target, probably Target. Oh, this stuff is so good. It's so nice. Um, and get my grocery stuff that I need and, or maybe go somewhere else for groceries and Target, but I really need a vacuum and some other random stuff at Target, so I'll give you guys a little Target haul if I do that. But I need to take a break from cleaning the bathroom, I'm like so tired. Um, I'm gonna come back probably and just finish, do the toilet and the countertops, so it won't take too long. Oh, I did the mirror too with the Windex already, so I'm gonna go put that stuff away, put the trash bag away, I'm gonna take out my all my boxes and put them in the trash room. Um, Wow, this stuff is so nice. I love it. Oops. But yeah, I do need to do that stuff. Sorry, I'm not being clear. I do need to like go to Target, get some grocery stuff, and a vacuum really badly. I just want to vacuum the floors. I haven't done that yet, like since I moved in, which is kind of a problem. My mouth feels like gross and dry. Um, whenever I use like cleaning solution and stuff, I feel like it makes my throat really dry. But I've been drinking this little water. So brush my teeth. I'm gonna shower once I come home because I don't know. I don't really like to go out and then like come back and shower. I like to like shower more before I'm gonna like get all clean right before I get into my bed. Cause if I know that I like just went out. I don't know, it's like kind of gross. I do it sometimes, but like I'd rather not. And I'm not really in the mood to shower right now. Anyway, so. Oh, I don't want to get back. There's like something stuck in my throat, I feel like. Let me brush out my lashes too. And I'm still wearing my little aloe pants, lounge pants. And I put on this Skims tank, the white one, because I was sweating in my hoodie when I was cleaning. And I, oh, did I say this? Oh, I told you guys I was watching the D'Amelio show, but uh, yeah. started watching Dance Moms because I was looking for a different show to watch on Hulu. But I literally, like Dance Moms was my childhood. Me and Kylie would watch it all the time. And it was like just my favorite show ever. So I just like started on the first episode and I just went from there and it's like so many memories, but I love watching it for some reason. I got bored of the D'Amelio show. I hated it. It's really not a good show. Okay. I have so many eyelashes this time. It's like amazing. I'll update you guys in a little, probably. You guys, look at all of the stuff I have to take out. All these boxes. And then I have two trash bags. Don't ask me why, honestly. Don't ask me why I have two trash bags. Oh, I'm not gonna be able to stick like this. Um, because I really don't have an answer. It's because one of them I brought into the bathroom while I was cleaning and then one of them is just my like food trash and my like, not food trash, my like kitchen trash that I just had and I wanna take them both out. Um, I'm excited to go to Target for and get all the stuff I need. Oh, oh, no feet. Paper towels, a paper towel holder. I don't know, I have notes, obviously a vacuum, just random stuff that I'm super excited about. And yeah, I'll probably figure out what to have for dinner too. But wish me luck as I take all this stuff to the trash room. Okay, so I actually, I know I said I was about to go to Target and then I ended up going to Whole Foods because I was like, I want dinner and I need groceries and I just needed to go to Whole Foods, I don't know. I wanted, I was hungry and I was like, and Target's much farther away than I thought it was, and I don't know. I just, I needed food. That's my number one priority right now. So I got the food. I got a bunch of good groceries. I got some salmon and rice for like a salmon rice bowl. I got um, some pre, I got like a pre-made um, chicken Caesar wrap. I don't know, I got some good stuff. I'm gonna give you guys a haul once I get back, but I'm gonna go, or head back now. I opened this bag of barbecue chips on my, or while I was shopping, cause I was starving. And it's so hard to grocery shop when you're hungry. But I'm gonna head back home now and then I can show you guys all my Whole Foods stuff. I also bought two of the reusable bags. I didn't realize I didn't realize they had just like plain black ones, so I had to get these weird ones. Or they're not weird, they just say like Whole Foods 
all over the place and they are bright green and not cute so i wish i knew <laughs> that there were cuter or there were just like plain black ones because i would have totally bought those maybe i can bring the bags back and just switch them out maybe i'll do that next time um but these are good to have because i literally can't carry anything up well first of all there it, it is four flights of stairs but i could take the elevator but it's still like a long walk and i park my car somewhere and then i walk from my car and then there's just like a lot of stuff and i had two grocery bags from stop and shop and they did not have handles no i had three and they did not have handles and it was impossible i had to take three trips like literally it was so hard so and even if they do have handles the bags are just falling apart you get so many bags when they have handles so it's just so annoying it's not even really about saving the environment at this point but that's just the added bonus i guess starting route to home proceed we're gonna go home and then i'll show you guys what i got hey you guys just got back to the apartment um I want to give you guys a little Whole Foods haul. First, I got the barbecue chips that I opened and couldn't stop eating while I was shopping. Then I got a salmon. <laughs> I want to make this, uh, make like salmon rice bowls, so I got salmon for that. And then oh, the rest isn't in here, but soy sauce for it. And then I got sourdough bread for avocado toast. And rotisserie chicken. <laughs> so it's like open. Because I want to make like chicken, chicken noodle soup. So I thought a rotisserie chicken would be perfect. This is what I was talking about the ugly bags, but whatever. I got two apples. Because I was gonna get caramel with them, but I forgot. So whatever. I got um, chipotle mayo for the salmon rice bowls. And then I got, let me turn you guys a little bit. Guac. Um, raspberries, sorry. I'm like blanking on everything. I got two kinds of sushi which I think this is about to be my dinner because I'm not gonna make the salmon rice bowls right now or anything. I'll probably make them for lunch tomorrow and then like have them for dinner as well or something like that because I feel like I'll need them for two meals. But for sushi, I got one um, like crunchy shrimp tempura roll and then one spicy California roll. Oh, I'm, I'm gonna show you guys. One, I already showed it, but yeah, those two. I got raspberries, but I didn't get strawberries. I don't know why. Um, chicken Caesar wrap. This would be good to like take to work or something, but I don't know how long it will be good for. Rice for the salmon rice bowls, obviously. I got some cheese for um, either like scrambled eggs or I was gonna get pesto for pesto eggs and I couldn't find it anywhere. Um, or just like I don't know something else, but I also got pico de gallo for this and not for the guac, but yeah with guac and I already have chips. I'm gonna at some point make like little taco bowls and get like ground beef and sour cream. I just didn't get all that today because I feel like I've got a lot of food already or like meal food so I don't need to get more meals but that's also what the cheese is for kind of. Lastly, I got these oatmeal raisin cookies that I bought um, last time I was at Foods and they're so amazing. They're like chewy and I, I just love oatmeal raisin cookies so. If you need to. Yeah. Not everything. I will begin to put it all away now. Hey you guys, good morning. I'm checking the weather right now. I know I told you guys that this vlog would just be like one day. I was gonna do like a reset day for Friday, but I decided I'll carry it along to Saturday because um I didn't do much yesterday, first of all. And second of all, um, I'm gonna get my nails done today, I think. Well, I made an appointment at this new place, or it's not new, but it's new to me because it's like four minutes from my apartment and it looks really, really nice. So I'm excited to try it out. And I'm gonna get a manicure pedicure because I need to do that. And I'm going to Nantucket this week, actually. I kind of forgot about it, but we're going for Thanksgiving. So I'm going just for like two nights. Uh, 
but yeah that should be fun um but yeah i thought i'd just do a two day long vlog because i'm probably also gonna go to target today um i woke up and took a shower because i didn't shower yesterday like what i just like knocked out fell asleep and totally forgot about it because i was gonna shower like once i got home from target well i never went to target but i guess the grocery store but i don't know um so i woke up and showered right away i didn't wash my hair because i don't need to wash my hair i don't think today or yeah i'll wash it tomorrow um but i'm gonna go get some coffee and then I think just come back and chill for a little bit. Oh, I was gonna do my closet because I didn't do my closet. I just like deep cleaned my bathroom, but I haven't done my closet. Um, I still have to wipe down the countertop and the toilets actually. So I'm gonna do that. I'll do like countertop and the bathroom and the sinks and the toilet, I'll clean that. And then I'll organize the closet once I get back from getting coffee. But then um, later today, I'm gonna get my nails done at two. I made the appointment for it's 10 30 in the morning i woke up at like 9 30 which is so early or it's not that early but it's early for me on a saturday so whatever and yeah then i just took a shower and then i made my nail appointment for two o'clock so i'm super excited for that um i'll take you guys with me and see how this place is i don't know what to get yet i got this like tannish nude with chrome over it last time and it's fine but i don't know what to get now <laughs> My one is broken, obviously. But, yeah, I don't know what to get today. I'll keep thinking about it. But I just put on my little aloe wide leg pants and skims. Zip up again and skims. Tick. So that's the deal right now. I did just check the weather and it looks like it's chilly. So I'm going to throw on a jacket. This is actually Kylie's Sam coat. Because I left mine at... Jack's birthday party at this bar in Boston and I called and they had it like last week and I haven't gotten it yet and I have to get it and I'm being so bad about it because it's like in Boston this place it's like in the city so I don't know I mean now that I think about it I should just have my cousin get it for me because she lives in the city she doesn't have a car that's the only thing but she seemed like she like knew the people who worked at that place so i feel like she could get it for me if i actually asked her i'm just scared that they're gonna like throw it away or get rid of it or something um which i hope they don't do i know they do it with credit cards they'll like cut up credit cards after a few days if no one claims them but like it's not the same as a credit card it's a freaking jacket you know so i would kind of expect more <laughs> that they would care more about it you know but yeah, I've been wearing Kylie's in the meantime because I literally just found it in um, my coat closet in my house. And I guess she didn't take it to her apartment or whatever, so it's mine until further notice. But open the shades. It's a nice, beautiful day out. Actually, this is the best lighting. Wow. Um, but yeah, it's actually cold. That's why I'm wearing my jacket, but... <laughs> I'm going to get coffee and is that it? all I wanted to say to you guys? I guess we'll go get coffee and then come back and do like organizing stuff and then just get ready for nail appointment later. Um, hi guys. I just got my coffee. Same thing as always, but the ice is weird. It's not like the tiny little ice cubes. They're like huge squares and I feel like it's not the normal Dunkin' Ice at all but whatever i don't really care that much um there is a tj maxx right there so i'm gonna run into there and see if there's anything that is on my list that i can cross off <laughs> like maybe there's a vacuum maybe there's a paper towel holder like maybe there's a trash can i don't know random stuff i need from target and target's just so far so if i can like get it done places near here i'd rather do that so i'm gonna run into that tj maxx I've, I've been into a tj maxx actually one time but i don't know what really they sell at all in my head they're similar to a target but i think that that's wrong so i think they're more like uh like marshall's i don't know i've never been to marshall's like i don't know i haven't been to many places like i'll go like like i'll stick to the same places usually when i live near a target i would just go to target for everything but now since i'm kind of farther away 
I'd rather go to places closer, so I want to experiment TJ Maxx and see what they got in there. Maybe it'll be a whole new experiment, or a whole new amazing time or something. Like, maybe I'll just discover that I love TJ Maxx, so we'll see how it goes. You guys missed some of Kurt's so bad. Oops. But let's see what you... TJ Maxx haul. Show you guys what I got. First, the things that aren't in the bags. I got a trash can for my bathroom. The lid is like, it's like not on right, or it's not like, like, I don't know, whatever. I don't really care. No one will notice that, but just a little white trash can. Cute. And then this is my favorite thing ever. I'm so excited to hang this on the door. I got a wreath because my neighbors have wreaths and I was like, I need one. Look how freaking cute that is. So I'm gonna hang that on the door literally right now. Other things I got, this toilet bowl cleaner. They'll match nicely. And I feel like I need a toilet bowl cleaner. Everything here at this place is so freaking cheap. Well, not everything, but like all the stuff that, I don't know, like everything was a great price. I've never been, I already said that, you guys know I've never been there, which is why it was such a shocker to me, but okay, we'll take the stickers off after. I got chip clips, because I needed them for my chips last night. This was an impulse buy at the register. I got cl clips for um, Christmas colors, look how cute, and I think this bright red one will match my bright red Sam coat so well. And that's gonna look so cute together. I needed like for dishes, this was on my target list. I needed like sponges, so I got these sponges and a whatever that is thing to scrub the dishes. And then this is the last thing. And this is my favorite thing ever. And I'm hoping it'll fit me. I hope Kylie doesn't see this, but if it doesn't fit me, I'm gonna give it to her as her Christmas present probably. But it's the cutest PJ set I've literally ever seen. So it's black. I don't have a long sleeve black PJ set which I've kind of been dying for, but it's a million times better because it's fuzzy and cheetah print. And it like buttons down like those peaches. It's like, it's, it's like so, can you see? It's so cute. It's fuzzy black and cheetah print. Like, are you kidding? I'm scared about the pants though. Cause, so I got a medium, did I say that? That's the only size or the smallest size they had, but the pants don't even have a tie. So like, I'm gonna have to figure this out because the top will obviously fit me, but the pants won't. I don't know, maybe there's like something I can do about that. Let me know if you guys have ever made pants fit you that don't have like an adjustable tie, but this is the cutest set ever. And it was like under $30, it was like 29 something, which is insane. Um, okay, I'm gonna put everything away now. And I'll talk to you guys later. My nail appointment's in like two hours now. You guys. My stomach hurts so bad. I don't know what's going on. But I just like, I just like went into my bed because I left everything out here when I was about to deal with all of my stuff. And I like ran to my bed because I couldn't be standing anymore. Like it hurt so bad. But then I took some Pepto-Bismol and now I'm kind of okay. I'm just shivering because I just turned the heat on and it hasn't done it yet or whatever. But I'm a little bit okay now. It's been like, uh, maybe 30 minutes. Yeah, it's 12 16 and my nail appointment's at 2. I'll probably be fine to go there, right? I don't know. I'm scared. I feel like I'm getting better though, so maybe I'll be fine. But I'm about to go hang. I put on, I took off my pants and my clothes when I was dying in my bed a few minutes ago. But I just put on this huge t shirt and my little slippies because I want to go hang up my wreaths. So badly. I'm so excited about this. So. Let me take off the tag, though. Okay. And I have this little command hook. I think this is the right size, or the best size for the wreath. And then it's like, um, these will Velcro into each other, so I have to go put this on the outside of the door. And I have to figure out, like, how I want it. Or, like, where, because I want to be able to still see through the people. I don't know. I'm going to go do it, and then I'll... Actually, yeah, then I'll be back. Okay, that was way easier than I thought. Look at it. How cute. Oh my god. 
Okay, I wanted to show you guys. I almost forgot because I took one bite already, but I made some avocado toast. I just did sourdough, um, cream cheese, and then avocado mash with salt, pepper, and red chili flakes. So I'm so excited to eat this because I haven't eaten yet today. And it's 1 p.m. <laughs> but Dana's on his way over and we're gonna hang out. And I'll probably update you guys later. Hi. I'm just like waiting for it to focus, but I don't think it ever is gonna. I never ended off the vlog that I was filming. I think it was like a, oh no. It was like a reset day or it was like a few days of resetting. I wish I could prop it up like this, but you can't see me. <laughs> um, but it's a couple days later now. I actually just got back from my Nantucket trip for Thanksgiving. I didn't vlog it because it wasn't too eventful, but I had a great time. It was very relaxing. I was only there for like one night, but um, I wanted to come on here and quickly update you guys. So I wanted to end off this vlog, but I also wanted to come on here and update you guys or just kind of talk for a little bit. First, I wanted to show you guys I ordered a few things off Amazon on Black Friday and I have everything linked in my storefront. I'll link the storefront down below, but I wanted to show you guys some of the stuff that I ordered because I'm super excited. I can't wait um, for like after, oh, well not after Christmas, I'm so excited for Christmas, but I can't wait for like, I feel like after, right after Christmas, I'll have like finally everything I want for my house to like feel like a home and feel like super homey. Right now, it feels homey to me, but I feel like there's just certain things like like I just have like furniture but I never sit on my couch I hate my couch I want to sell it and get a new one it's so uncomfortable and it's tiny and if I if the couch was comfortable and bigger and like actually comfortable I would be on it all the time and that's why I get annoyed because I'm either sitting here or in my bed so I want a new couch that's what I'm asking for for Christmas and then um I'm gonna sell that couch probably and I also want another TV. I want a bigger one for this living area and then I'm probably gonna put that one in the little one in my bedroom and try to mount it onto the wall. So yeah, and then I ordered bar stools for this countertop from I think like Overstock. That sounds right. Um, but I did get ones from Amazon, they're right here in that big box behind me, but they ended up being way too short. So I got taller bar stools that are just white and gold. They're super pretty, I can't wait. And I just asked for a lot of like wall art from um, my mom. She asked me like what I want for Christmas. And I, well, I decided mainly I was gonna like, I want apartment stuff because this is like, you know, my apartment time. I wanna make sure it's super homey and whatever. And I love it so much. So I don't like this being zipped up like that. But um, so that's kind of what I decided. I was gonna like revolve the Christmas gifts around, but um, I'm trying to like look on Facebook marketplace and stuff for a couch because I want it to be cheaper so I can not have to spend a lot of money on couch and uh, whatever. <laughs> but uh, I, like I love my rug, I love my coffee table, I love the TV table, I love the lamps, I love the mirror, I love the decorations, I love that little chair. I just don't like the couch and I feel like once the couch is switched and in, in, into a couch that I like, it'll be so much better. So I can't wait for that. And then I got a Christmas tree, which will go in the back little area. I should just show you guys what I'm talking about. This is the couch I hate. I love this chair. I asked for a similar one for maybe the other side so I can match, see how small the TV is. And I need an Apple TV, which is actually at my house in Wellesley. And then I have all of this space with nothing to do. So my idea was, and I'll sh I promise I'll show you the Amazon orders in a second, but my idea for the back area was, well, first we'll see how big the couch is. Like if I get a bigger couch, I wanted kind of like a sectional. So maybe I won't have any space behind the couch anymore. But if I do, I want to do like the Christmas tree back there. And then I was thinking like Anna Hyde, she just moved into her, like, apart like um, her first apartment alone. And she's doing this little like fake fireplace thing. It's just like a mantle kind of. And I think she's doing like candles inside or maybe like getting a fake, fireplace type of thing I don't know but I love that idea of just doing like a little mantle like a nice white like little mantle thing against the other wall over there over in you know behind the couch area and then my Christmas tree can go there the mantle will go there and I can do like 
I also was looking up Facebook Quaker Place. I wanted two couches. I want a big white sectional and then a smaller, similar to this one, but I want it to be a pull-out couch and I want it to be like something that I could like have guests actually sleep on, like an actual bed couch. Not that, that's so uncomfortable. I would never force someone to sleep on that. But, and then that little couch could be the pull-out, it could be like a pull-out sofa, so it could be like the couch for that little other area. So it could be like a couch facing the fireplace or mantle or whatever and the Christmas tree. And then um, this will be like the TV watching area and then behind it will be like just the hangout sitting relaxing by the fireplace little area. Like I love that. So I think I'm gonna do that. I'm super excited about that. And I got a Christmas tree, I got lots of stuff. So let me show you guys what I got. But let me know if you guys have any recommendations, ideas. I feel like I just have a lot of space that I don't know what to do with. And I just have so many options. So I'm so, so excited. But I love the idea of having like two little kind of separate sitting areas, like the TV area is the TV area. And then the little quiet sitting area over there is like the little sitting area, you know? My mom also just recently did that. She did, she made a little quiet room for herself and she's changed like our childhood playroom into that kind of, well, not my childhood. I moved into the house when I was like six. So more like my little sister's playroom. Um, she's too old for playroom obviously. So she changed that to like her quiet room and she's been like having so much fun with that. So that's kind of like more inspired me to do that as well. I feel like that would be such a good idea. And then maybe I'd put the full length mirror in the, I don't know where I'd put it actually, probably wherever the best like background is. But yeah, so let me know if you guys have any ideas. I feel like after I figure out what to do with that little back area space or I get like, you know, whatever, figure out the couches and stuff, then like we'll be good with like arranging here. Like everything, I like the table here, I like that there, like there, like everything will be good where it is and then I'll just have to organize. The other thing I haven't done yet is my closet. I'm gonna do that today. I'm literally gonna do it like right after I'm done filming this, but I'm doing my closet today and I'm editing today so I can upload this video for you guys. But since it is Black Friday, or it was yesterday, I'm sorry. Um, I'm gonna show you guys what I ordered on Amazon and then everything will be linked to my storefront down below. And please give me ideas, recommendations for my space, what you, get, what you guys think I should do with it. So right now I think, and let me know if you guys agree, I think we keep this how it is, but maybe try to get a bigger, comfortable or sectional type couch for the TV. And then behind it we'll do Christmas tree, a cute little mantle maybe situation, and the pull-out couch, just like a smaller kind of pull-out couch, but still comfortable, you know? Um, and that will be like facing the fireplace, or I'm not gonna be like an actual fireplace, but you know what I mean? So yeah, so let me show you guys what I ordered from Amazon. So first, I got a trash can. <laughs> Some things I just got that are like random for my house, but I've been needing a trash can, so this one looked good. It's just a big white one. I'm still deciding where I'm gonna put that, but we'll talk about that once it like actually arrives, obviously. Um, and then another thing that I needed for my apartment is a silverware like drawer organizer. So this is adjustable. So I'm hoping it'll fit into my drawer perfectly and it's clear like acrylic. So I think that'll be pretty. Also for my closet, I organized half of it before I left for Nantucket and now I just have to do the second half. And it's huge. There's so much space. There's so much shelves. The only thing is there's no like bins or like places to store like shirt, like not shirts, like shorts or like things that don't be folded or don't get hung up really. So I wanna do these cute little bins. I got, I think three of the jumbo size. So I think that'll be good for at least to start to organize my closet. And then if I need more, I can order more. Um, and then these are just lights for my Christmas tree. Not super fun, but they're remote controlled and they have um like different color choices so i thought that was fun and then i also got since i have so much hanging up space and like not as much well i do have a lot of shelf space but it's just not like organized like it's not like that organized so i thought since i have like the space to hang up as much as i want i'll hang up my jeans and my like leather pants so i got little like pants and skirt hangers so we can hang like my skirts and you know go whatever um <laughs> And then arriving Tuesday, I actually think I accidentally ordered two of something, but I got just kitchen scissors, so the KitchenAid little scissors. I don't have kitchen scissors. I literally do not have scissors, so I'm crazy. But I got a tree skirt, and this looks like I ordered two of it because there's two like confirmations. But this is just a super cute little like it's a knit like little knit. I don't know tree skirt. I don't I don't know. I think that'll look cute and it'll like kind of match my apartment. So. <coughs> the one that looks like my knit blanket over there um they sell it on curtain barrel but it's like so expensive so i got this one instead 
I think this one will be better. And for some reason, it looks like I ordered two of the tree skirts and I can't find the tree. Like, where's the tree that I ordered? <laughs> oh, here it is. Oh, it's arriving December 7th. Ugh, I wanted to put it, it was supposed to arrive the first and I wanted to put it up the first, but it's an unlit tree because I got the trees or got the lights obviously, but it's super cute. It was pretty cheap for a six foot tree. I wanted a six foot tree because my ceilings are high. My, I have nine foot ceiling. That might be a lot. No, I think they're, they're, they're high. I've got high ceilings. So I wanted like not a tiny dinky, like weird looking tree. Like I have so much space. So I wanted a big one. And what are we going to do with it when it's not Christmas season? Who knows? We'll find a place for it. So that's it for this vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed. I really don't even remember what I filmed. Well, I know I did like two days of like resetting kind of. So I hope you guys liked it. Um, I got my nails done before, or recently and I didn't show you guys. So aren't they cute? I went to this new place right near my apartment. Um, but yeah, that's it for the vlog. I love you guys so much. Check out my Amazon storefront for all those Amazon things. And I will keep you guys updated with all the apartment stuff and my life and everything. And I love you guys so much. Bye.